Hey guys, it's Jay from ChopHappy.com. Welcome to my New York City kitchen. Today we are gonna make a tangy ginger dressing that takes a minute to make and lasts all week in your fridge. And the best part, guys, if you're as busy as me, it could be a marinade, it can go on salad, and it lasts all week and super easy. So, in true Chop Happy style, I tried to prepare as much as I could in advance so that we could chop happy. So I have a half a cup of extra virgin olive oil, and then my best friend in the kitchen and microplane, you really should invest in this, because it grates your garlic and your ginger so that it's not nice and smooth throughout all your meal. I have two garlic cloves grated and I have an inch of ginger, which is about your thumb, um, grated as well too. And then we're gonna go in twosies and onesies. So let's start with the twosies. So teaspoons, I mean. So two teaspoons of soy sauce. And I love soy sauce, Tom makes fun of me. I throw it all over my rice. And then two teaspoons of rice vinegar or um, seasoned rice vinegar. It doesn't matter, this recipe works. Either one that you have in the cabinet. And now onesies. My secret non-Asian ingredient, but I love to put in all my dressings, is Dijon mustard. I put a teaspoon in there. And that just makes this look really creamy without using any cream. And then my surprise ingredient, maple syrup for some sweetness. Instead of honey or agave or any of that stuff, I put maple syrup in there. Oh my God, doesn't that look so good? And so easy, this is a quick thing. And some salt, I'm gonna put a pinch or a half a teaspoon of salt in there because we already have salt in the soy sauce and whisk it all together. You can use a fork. If you don't have a whisk or you don't want to dirty a whisk, it works just as good. Voila, and in less than a minute, you have a homemade ginger dressing, cheaper than store-bought and delicious. Look at that. Oh, oh my God, here we go. Mm. Oh my God, it's so good. This is better than store-bought. I taste that mustardy tang in the background, but that salty, sweet, umami soy sauce that I love so much all over soaking on my rice. This is so good. You guys totally gotta make this. Leave this in your fridge all week. Marinate with it. Throw it on a rice bowl. Oh my God, or just a salad, or just dip some lettuce in here. Mm, or bacon. All right guys, I love you. Go on to ChopHappy.com for more dressing and more easy recipes. So even if it's a busy day, you can have a delicious meal. And I will see you later. Please subscribe to ChopHappy.com or the YouTube page. Yay, thank you guys.